Greetings all. Last Outrider here and still alive. It's true. And I have come out of semi-retirement to say, what do I think about Henry Cavill uh, and GW joining Amazon to, to make a, a series? I know a lot of people are excited about this, and honestly, I am one of them. What do I think about that, though? What is there to be excited about? Well, my answer to people when we talk about this has been, it, de it depends on how GW is going to view this opportunity. There are three different possibilities to go here. The first is the Horus Heresy. This right now is the most developed storyline in 40K. That lends it well to making a multi-season story arc that is more guaranteed to be a success than trying to create original content. And so... I think that would be the best route to go. The other possibilities are, you know, adapting one of the novels to a TV series. That's kind of iffy. Or creating original content in the current 40K universe and that would be the most risky of all so of these three different choices i would definitely say go for the horace heresy you don't have to make an adaptation of the novels you just have to make you just have to tell the story in a made for tv format the question then would be, who are you going to follow through the Horus Heresy? You know, you'd have to have some uh, characters or storyline that shows both sides. You know, you'd have to have Horus over here doing his thing at the beginning uh, and his turn to chaos. And you'd have to have people on Terra and everything like that. It's such a huge story that they would somehow have to find one thread of this story and turn it into a TV series. That is my guess on the best route GW would go for this. And will that be a success is the question. People keep on talking about is the 40k fan base large enough to make a successful TV series, even with Henry Cavill starring in it? And my answer is it doesn't matter. No fan base is large enough to make a successful series if the series is shit. And if you want an example of this, just look at the last three Star Wars movies. There's a big fan base. Still can't turn shit into diamonds. There's the um, Lord of the Rings Ring of Power. Rings of Power. Um, is it good or bad? I'm going to leave that up to those fans to decide. But it's just an example of another large fan base is not capable of turning bad storytelling into something popular. Um, on the other hand, look at The Boys. One of the most popular shows on Amazon. What was the fan base for that when the, before they started? So this really has to come down to writing. And at GW, some of the authors, many of the authors in the Black Library have 
screenplay writing experience. Uh, Dan Abnett being one of them, obviously. So there is a possibility, a good possibility, and if they have the funding and the the quality to actually truly create a good story independent of it being in a 40k universe just look at andor on disney plus right you wouldn't even care if that was a star wars movie or show or not it wouldn't matter you could completely strip star wars from andor it would still have a following same with the mandalorian uh, Star Wars is just kind of secondary to the fact that people want to watch these storylines. Whereas on the other hand, Boba Fett, one of the most popular characters in Star Wars, crappy series, fan base doesn't matter. So if that is the most important lesson to be learned from this, story is always first. Fan base, the IP the actors, it's all secondary. That, if, with, with that in mind, this can be either a guaranteed success or a guaranteed failure. I, I hope they understand that. I hope that, I, I think they do. I think people, I mean, professionals like uh, Dan Abnett and um, uh, the guy who wrote Butterfly Effect, uh, they have a number of talented screenwriters there, and they, they, they definitely have to sit down, and this is going to be the story writing of their careers to make, to, to bring the Warhammer 40K cinematic universe to life, because one story is not going to be enough. That's one of the first things I would say. Uh, the, 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 there would obviously end up being more. But you, either way, no matter how you look at this, you have to have an absolutely fantastic, high-quality story writing for any of this to work. And that is my opinion on this. Next time, I'm going to make a video about i think the these these leagues that i'm still going to call them squats i don't care and and what i think of them i've been waiting on that to see how gw develops their storyline but well i'll tell you next time until then bye